She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something bad Welcome back to my channel. Oh, let me not. Oh, let's try that again. Let's try that again. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, then welcome, welcome, welcome. My name is Mariana, and I'm so happy to meet you, y'all. <laughs> I just have on a face mask, so I can't really do any like antics with my face, really. But um, I decided since I'm a since I'm doing a little bit of self care because y'all know I told y'all I expressed how I felt like in my last lockdown vlog. I already explained to you guys how I've been feeling lately. So I decided, you know what, let me give myself a tad bit of self-care. So I currently have on a face mask. I do apologize, I didn't show you guys um, facial because I did like a mini facial for myself just now. And well, it's just my mask on right now. The mask that I have on, I will insert pictures of what it is. It's the... Um, clay mask and I put some turmeric in it as well as some apple cider vinegar so that's what I have on my face to tighten them pores to tighten them pores it's currently Monday evening by the way I'm just having a nice chilled relaxing evening um, after this I am going to I told you guys I wanted to try some sugar wax and Lord uh, okay I made some sugar wax the other day y'all will see a, there'll be a dedicated video to that coming next week but for now yeah I'm about to do a sugar wax on myself today as well as I'm gonna do a pedicure because Lord my feet my feet is in a hot 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 mess so I wanted to give myself a little mini pedicure because I like I don't really like doing pedicures and stuff my feet are very ticklish that's what i'm up to this evening just a nice chill relaxing evening and uh, yeah okay you guys so i i just had a nice warm shower and i removed my face mask but Lo and behold, I have another one on my face. Let me just show you guys real quick the one that I'm that I have on right now. This is the one that you saw me purchase in my last Pennywise haul, and this is the Freeman Hydrating Cactus and Cloudberry Water Gel Mask. It is a leave-on mask. Um, it's for all skin types, and it basically says it that it instantly refreshes and brightens for nourished skin. You guys, let me just tell you. This face mask is working wonderfully for me so far. done with my pedicure as you can see my face mask is still on my face but Christian and I are about to make dinner <laughs> so um, what we're actually doing though we're gonna try Jacob's pumpkin rice with salt fish I don't remember the exact name of it but I will link his video right up here in the cards up above me right here for you guys to check that out i'm gonna try because we have some lentils in the fridge to have that with so that's what's for dinner tonight so yeah so guys we have some brown rice cooking here jacob used uh, parboiled rice but you know i don't cook with that so have some brown rice cooking here and a little bit of saltfish right there I forgot to let you know that um, I just seasoned my rice up with the green seasoning that I made fresh green seasoning basically blended green seasoning and I just dumped it in the rice to add flavor to the rice okay so Jacob said to fry up the salt fish this is 
we boiled the swordfish as you guys saw before and then after we drained it we fried it up in some oil and he said to do it very crispy so we declared this swordfish crispy crispy <laughs> Listen to the crispiness. And the rice is here. I'm just um, letting, it. I just put this towel in it to absorb the moisture. Because you know, you have to cook, um, the way that you cook brown rice is different from parboiled rice. So I'm just letting it absorb the moisture before I fluff it. And we have the pumpkin here getting all mushed up. some parsley to this rice because I think it'll help but it'll make it taste really good okay y'all and this is the finished product it smells so good I'm not gonna lie okay guys so it is taste test time y'all um, well to be fair Christian already tasted it so you can go ahead and tell them no wait let me taste it first and then you can go ahead and tell them your uh, mosquito leaf me alone. Yeah, you could go ahead and tell them after I taste mine, you could go ahead and tell them what your take on it is. Okay, I'll still pretend like it's my first time too though. <laughs> Cheers. Wow. Mmm. It's really good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Seriously, I this is a this would have to be like one of my new ways of doing that brown rice because you know the plain brown rice do not taste good at all. <laughs> this masks the taste of the brown rice. I find like I get the taste, but like I get of the, the brown, brown rice. Yeah, I get the brown rice taste, but it, yeah. it suits with it well. What? And I'll get a nice chunky piece of the sawfish. Oh my gosh! <laughs> it tastes so good! Oh wow! Yo! It's really nice with the lentils too. Yeah. Oh, I didn't try it with the lentils. Let me try it with the lentils. Sorry about that with my phone. Let me try it with the lentils. It's really good with the lentils. But I prefer it on its own. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yo. Well, let me try it with the avocado. Question don't, eat, don't like avocado, so. Oh. Mm. That, that looks like some mind blowing. I like it. Mmm. I love it with the avocado. Seriously, y'all, you should definitely try this. Like seriously, I'm not even kidding. You should definitely try this and it will be perfect. It tastes perfectly fine on its own. Like you don't need to add anything to it. It tastes real good on its own. Like it can be just, you don't need any sides or anything like that to go to it. It's perfectly, like it's like a pillow. So I snuck a taste and told her what I thought about the rice before, when, when she was now getting her plate ready. And I was telling her that I've only ever really had pumpkin in like Kalaloo or with roti and And 
So, well, the other times I've tried pumpkin in something, it wasn't my... It didn't really... Like I got pumpkin soup and it, it, it was meh. It wasn't the greatest thing in the world. So I was not super excited to try this. I was just kind of curious about how it would taste. And now I think this is one of my like new favorite dishes because it's amazing. Try it out guys. Try it, you might like it. Try it, you will like it. Try it, you might like it. What's happening? Okay, okay. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Sunday morning, waking up with you. We got no plans, we got nothing to do. You tell me. The coffee Sunday morning Easy love With you Okay, okay, okay I'm your sunshine mixed with a little hurricane White hot angel with the dead devil's brain This feeling I just can't fight it You know all the ways I like it My north, you're my south, you're my east, you're my west When you see me at my worst, try to make me feel my best This love we just can't deny it You know all the ways I like it You holding me tangled up in these sheets Holding you Hello everyone, happy Tuesday to you all. Hope you guys are all doing well. Um, literally just spent the day cleaning and I didn't want to film that because it. I did that in my last lockdown vlog so I didn't want to like be too repetitive, right? Um, anyway, I am, um, hello. It's my nephew. <laughs> you okay? Yes. Okay. Anyway, you guys, so we just went to Extra Foods, picked up a few stuff, and I, um, um, as you guys can see in this clip before, I just put some um, vegetables to roast in the oven, just the same way that I did it in my What I Eat In A Day video, in my last What I Eat In A Day video. That dinner is basically sort of a staple for me because it's so easy, easy, easy to make, and it tastes so delicious um so yeah that's in the oven right now and that will go with the pumpkin rice and saltfish that we had last night jacob's pumpkin rice and saltfish and the lentils so yeah that'll be our treat for dinner now let me show you guys real quick what we picked up at uh extra foods so i'm gonna go in the order that it was cast right so since it'll be easier this way for me so i picked up we picked up this big ben's um fries it is 2.5 kg and that was $26.99. Now, y'all know I don't really like do deep fried much. So, um, I, well, I don't do that home at all, period. By home, my Christian has an air fryer. So, I'm going to carry these there weekend and we're going to like fries it up. Selling all the secrets. <laughs> Picked up this pack of spooked turkey drumsticks for $17.58. Y'all, I said in my last video I wasn't gonna put you guys on to stuff anymore, you know. But this is something that, I, as much as I would love to keep it a secret, I cannot. Because the world, you guys deserve to taste this. It's so good, right? So this is just the Nestle Milo Nuggets. It's basically like little clumps of Milo covered in chocolate. Y'all, ugh. These, are, these were $5.99 each. I very rarely find these when I um, go to the, but I've, been like buying them since over a year now and I barely find them and when I go to the supermarkets at all so I just picked up four packs to kind of stock a little bit on them but y'all these trust the eye when I say you all definitely need to try this that is if you like Milo if you don't like Milo then forget about it but if you like Milo Listen, this is the best thing Milo ever made in life, right? You all should definitely try this. 
and leave one or two in this uh, one, leave one or two on the shelves for me please rainbow condensed milk for seven dollars and 99 cents y'all i finally found back my rooibos tea so this is the dilma natural rooibos tea it's naturally caffeine free and this and this is really good for you and uh, this was 31 dollars and 99 cents and you get 20 individually wrapped tea bags in it y'all we got this at a really good deal this universal cornflakes for 18 ounce this is the 18 ounce box for only 20 dollars steal of a deal a tin of pringles in cheddar cheese for 20 dollars you guys i'm filming and i'm not realizing that i did not bring out my um umbrella lighting i do apologize but we're not gonna change the scenery now so we're just gonna like roll with it right i i think you guys are, can still see well enough i've never had these before but christian picked them up as though he was pretty sure about them so this is a gallon moment choco ring in white chocolate it kind of looks like a mini donut white chocolate covered donut this was twelve dollars and 99 cents just picked up a kiss whole grain bread with rolled oats on it for twelve dollars and 49 sorry for fifteen dollars and fifty cents now i usually eat bread from my sister because she bakes the best bread but this is just to hold us until she makes more. <laughs> so yeah. Lasco soy food drink in the flavor strawberry. Simply because Christian has never had strawberry milk before. Um, he doesn't even know of Lasco. So <laughs> he needs to try it. By the way, this was $12.50. Caribbean flavors cardamom, whole cardamom for $6.99 some almonds um for seven dollars and 99 cents this is actually for my sister new zealand rennet free which is vegetarian cheese for 19 dollars and 85 cents a pack of peeled garlic for 11 dollars and 99 cents so i picked up this beets for the business as you guys know 13 dollars and 44 cents for four beets um uh ginger is going back up you guys it's now 20 dollars a pound and i picked up 15 dollars and 42 cents worth of it to make my tonic we picked up one pound of red onions for six dollars and 99 cents a pack of carrots five dollars and 99 cents you guys and this is the first time i saw these so we wanted to try these these were two dollars and 99 cents each sunshine cereals cocoa gems and y'all they have like little marshmallows on it so i can't wait to eat those we picked up two packs of those to try and one pack of the morning oats as well to try nuts and honey this was two dollars and 25 cents um yeah so these are regular morning oats but with nuts and honey in them so yeah i think that's everything there let's just see in the oven oh it doesn't look doesn't it look good dinner is almost ready you guys so guys i think i'm gonna end this vlog here because it is pretty long already i'm positively sure gonna start vlogging again tomorrow because i need to go to the market and pennywise so yeah thank you guys so much for watching i truly appreciate it if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already and be sure to click that notification bell so that you don't miss another upload from me i will see you guys on wednesday for my sugar waxing video and then back on sunday for our hopefully last lockdown vlog see you guys in my next video bye Mwah.